Hey guys, Clumsy here. Welcome to a brand new series of PC Building Simulator. We'll be starting career mode from scratch. A little bit of disclaimer though, I'm not an expert at this, so it will be kind of a blind leading the blind kind of thing. But we'll have fun along the way, alright? So hang in there. So let's start off a new game here. It has been like almost two years since I started, since I last played the game. So don't expect me to come up with any tricks, alright? It will be what you see is what I see, almost for the first time again. Alright, welcome to PC Building Simulator. To begin, go to your PC by the doorway and open the email program on the desktop you've got mail. Right, so welcome to our own shop, our own studio, however you want to call it, pretty fancy. It seems like performance has improved since the last time I played. They probably put in a lot of uh, optimizations along the way. So that's our PC. Let's go and pick it up. Put that down here. And they said to check the mail, right? Oh, nice. That's my desktop wallpaper on my actual desktop. Email. All right. Let's see. So Timbo2000 has a mail for us. Thanks for taking over the PC shop. Okay, so it looks like it came from someone else and it's being handed over to us. Company isn't doing very well. <laughs> I can guess we have negative 15 in the bank. Rent and energy bills come out monthly. Hello, adulting. Make sure you have enough money for them. The job on the go, which should help with the rent, okay? Use your thermal paste when putting it as CPU. Oh my goodness, how many of us have had this problem before? This is one of the worst things that you can do or you cannot do. I'm sure we'll all have lots of uh, horror stories building our own PCs. All right, good. So this is Uncle Tim. <laughs> so that's where the negative 15 comes from. He didn't leave us a single penny and he even borrowed 15 bucks for fuel. You know how it is. Now we know. All right. Anyway, what is this? Cloud notes. Hey, is this new? PC earlier forgot which power supply to buy to support the 3080. Fancy. Cloud notes app might say. Oh, this is new. Great app where you can write notes for PC building and check them whenever you need to. It's pretty handy. Should be with all your other apps ready to install. Also, also given your prototype working on which will enable this app in your inventory too. We'll have to look into that. I haven't seen that before. But that's great because things start off very simple in this game but they get then very very complex and you really have to take notes. Before I used to just type things off in notepad in a separate screen but having that actually here in game that is a brilliant move. Amazing. Alright so first job ever computer has been running slower than usual might have clicked on something i shouldn't have do you have a virus okay so first thing is we remove the virus and uh, the pc should be able to boot afterwards all right so that's the pc that we carried from outside so let's click to work on the pc you need to run a virus scan i like the way that it Gives you a bit of tutorial in the beginning. Pretty intuitive. Press 3 or the cable button. Okay, good. So here, you can use the mouse to rotate the PC. Plug in the keyboard. Plug in the mouse. Oh. And that will be the... Display port, I guess, and this is the power cable. Alright, so just click the cable and click where it highlights. For those who are not familiar with building your own PCs, this will be the great starting point for you. USB drive into the back of the PC so you can install the virus scanner. Okay, so let's install USB drive. Put that there. Now press P or the power button to turn the PC on. I like as much as possible to actually press the buttons. It just feels more real. So let's go with that. Instead of pressing P or pressing the button over here at the bottom, I would like to press the actual physical PC button. Nice startup sound. It's been a while since I heard that. 
Okay. So now, let's get into the screen here. Welcome to Omega OS, Operating System of Choice. Good. So we can add or remove programs. And because we plugged in our USB already, we should be able to install the virus scanner. It should work like so. I remember this music from when I last played this. This is very nice, very chill, perfect for the game. I've had a couple of requests over the months, over the years to play this again and start the series. And now I'm happy to do it again, now in the official PC Building Simulator channel. Thanks guys for the opportunity. Alright, start scanning this one. <laughs> what has this guy been doing? 359 files. We can only imagine which website he's visited. Yikes. Alright, let's clean the files. If only clearing out the viruses is that simple in real life. Alright, anyway, we can all hope. You have removed all the viruses. PC is ready to be returned to the client. Okay, so we pick up the PC, place it in the delivery area. Good. But let's be proper people here and shut it down properly here. Let's try and remove the cables. Remove the USB. I think later on or even now, maybe there's a shortcut that you can actually like just pick up the PC and everything will be automatically removed. But let's make it as realistic as possible, right? Okay, that's good. Now we can pick it up, place it here. Ah, and that would be good to go once we enter and check our mail. So from this point, let's say that's the job, remove viruses in green. Then we can say collect. There we go, beautiful. Simple as that and we're no longer in the red. 85 bucks to our name. Come back tomorrow to see if there are some more jobs to do. Okay, good start. Now where is that uh, Cloud Notes app? That would be a very nice thing to have. Cloud Notes, there it is. Let's check that out first before we end the day. <clears throat> yeah, sure. Even we mix the restart and everything. So many new funky things here now. Christmas decor, Halloween decor. Cool. There are some DLCs as well, but I haven't installed any of them for now. So this is the base game through and through. Cloud Notes. Ah, that's perfect. I see. Yes, that will come in handy. Okay, good. That's good. Let's shut down the PC. Let's close the lights. I think if you don't close the lights, you'll incur more. Um, your bills will be higher when it comes to pay them. So pretty realistic. Anyway, we can role play as much as we want. No active jobs that more normal it's worth checking. You've ordered any parts you need for tomorrow before going home. Okay. So that's us. Current day. End the day. Welcome January 2, 2018. Let's go to work. If only you could skip days like in real life as well. Skip all the Mondays. <laughs> Why is this open already? Ah, this is just the same switch. Ah, okay, okay. Gotcha. Alright, start things off. Can I not press the power button there? No. I to press P. Okay, that's fine. Funky. Fastest boot up ever. I'd want that for my PC. Alright. Let's see. So this is Uncle Tim. Discard that. We're good with this one as well. Thanks for fixing my PC. Booting faster than it has in years. Thanks, Gary. Make sure not to visit any of those funky websites again. You know what I mean. <laughs> good. Okay, what is this? Hi, graphics card has fried itself. Replace it with a GTX 970, a Sheen GTX 970. Like this is where it comes in, because people will have some notes for you. So he wants, for example, uh, a 
how do you say this so we say he wants a sheen gtx 970 no so we don't forget and this is from uh, queen britney something like that maybe then we can also have multiple notes for different jobs something like that depending on your style oh i love this absolutely love this thanks for implementing this guys actual notepad in the game that's so much easier all right but this is looking good but how the heck do we pay for that can we go negative more space on your computer more tony easy store 500 gig okay well why don't we accept everything Take a day to arrive, so end the current day by going to the workshop door. Buy your component. So this is where it shines as well. So you, you accept multiple jobs, right? You might say, well, I, it was already listed here. But it's easier if you take note of that. Because if you accept multiple jobs, like for example, this one, second one. He wants a Mortoni Easy Store 500 gig. So we can also list that here. Mortoni easy store 500 gig or better plus plus <laughs> all right let's accept that and then this one is removing viruses and cleaning out dust oh this is nice this is also perfect because this is like free you don't need to buy anything perfect for us who are starting out all right so we have those we've accepted all the jobs now we can go to the shop Move that over here. Oh, it would be nice if to have an extra monitor here. So you can have all these windows fit in place. And we know that we won't need to buy a GTX 1070. She in GTX 1070. 970. Sorry. Uh, let's just look for that. Sheen. GTX 970 is this one. Gamer. Is that the Gamer or Gamer XL? Oh, that's, that's why you should take more proper notes gamer or better i should have listed that okay gamer or better so this should be enough and then uh, mortoni easy store so we go to storage we go to mortoni and they want a 500 gig or better we don't have anything better that's it All right good cloud notes you saved my day okay time your delivery so let's say, what is this? We have a couple of parts. We have a next day delivery. We have a same day delivery, 100 bucks. Makes sense. More expensive if it's uh, faster. Can we buy that even without money? We could, but we went negative. How does that work? Your free overdraft limit is 1,000 if only banks are like that in real life. <laughs> But that's good. Okay, so we go. We can go up to negative 1,000. Perfect. All right, so we've bought the parts. We have gotten the jobs. So now we can shut down and move to the next day. I think you can also look at the calendar. One second. If you look at the calendar here. Yeah, you can see right now it's Jan 2, Jan 3. All those uh, PCs will arrive, these uh, orange ones. So, so those are the jobs. And then the green ones are the deliveries that are pending. So everything will happen tomorrow. Awesome. Great planning. With that off. See you guys tomorrow. There we go. Get to work. Indeed. PC parts are here as well. Ah, things are coming back to me. I'm loving this. So let's see. Which one do we want to do first? Let's go and do this one. I like this. Because this is quite representative of my real PC. <laughs> I'm a very lazy guy when it comes to cleaning my PC. Don't tell anyone. All right, press the install button. Okay, and get the compressed air. Ah, yes, yes, yes. This is amazing. All right, let's do this. Compressed air. Open the case before cleaning. Okay, fine. So let's remove that first. That makes sense. Remove the screws. awesome oh my goodness this looks filthy this looks familiar <laughs> all right now we can blow out the dust why is nothing happening 
I think the the dust has stuck in there. It's been there for quite some time. There we go. Things are taking shape. Come on. Oh, just like magic. Clean out dust. Okay. I think it's as clean as it can get. Alright, good. So from there, we just basically put in the USB drive and plug in the different cables. I think later on you can get an upgrade when where you can make this automatic because later on you'll be working with so many PCs that plugging cables in is going to be very trivial. So from here, it would be pretty much the basic thing as last time. Let's install back the PC part here. So this is the one that we removed. The PCI cover, is that ours? Oh. Let's bring that back. Screw that in. I think you, there's also an upgrade with the screws later. Auto screw or something. Virus scanner. Oh, I missed this game. This is the perfect game for these days. With all the supply shortages with the PC parts in real life, the best you could do is order them here virtually and assemble them here. Practice. So by the time the actual real life parts are available, you know what you have to do. Yeah, I must say, this actually helped me in my real life assembly. I recently assembled my PC, upgraded it, I got lucky and I got the 3080, care of Asus, and uh, let's clean that, that's good, okay, perfect, and yeah, working with PC building simulator, watching other videos for tutorials, gave me a bit of confidence to do it on my own. Alright, that looks good, let's see if we can do a shortcut, right click, yeah, everything is removed. So if you're trying to be as efficient as possible, that can actually work. All right. So that's one down. Let's power up our PC here. Get our new PC parts. So we have the GTX 1070 and the Mortoni. Nice. Which do, which do you guys want first? I want the graphics card first. That looks fancier. Okay. Let's remove the case part. And I like how this game actually has real parts in there. There are some fictional companies, but there are some very familiar ones. Is that Cryo Rig? It is Cryo Rig. My actual CPU cooler is a Cryo Rig. I think it's an H7. Anyway, okay, so let's remove the old uh, GTX 970. It's this one. But we'll need to remove the case part first here. Yeah, it teaches you a lot about these things. If it's your first time assembling a PC, if you've never assembled a PC before, it gives you a good this gives you a good idea of what other cases look like, how things work, what screws are there that you have to remove. So that's broken. You can sell that for eight bucks. Why not? Plug that back in, and yes, in real life it is as easy as that for a change. Let's install back that PCI cover. No, not really that one. How do we close this? One second. Because there's a screw there. Or is that good already? That, that one, okay. Ah, okay, so you just like, flip it over. Don't recall that from before. Put the screw here. And lock that out here. That's a nice touch. And let's boot up the... So if you just press this, nothing will happen because you still have to assemble the cables or connect the cables. Display port, HDMI, either one of those or this one. Keyboard and mouse and then the power cable. Power that up. While well, that's powering up, let's put in the case. Working efficiently here. Nice wallpaper guy. So that is good already. Nice, 116. And with these early stuff, you it's enough to assemble and install a GPU. But later on, I remember you actually have to like make sure that it's running. 
at a certain performance level. So you'll have to have like 3D mark and all that stuff. But right now, we start off simple. Good. Can we handle this one? Alright, let's try. So, PC can boot to OS. That works. Remove that. We can actually install a hard drive. Uh, like so. We'll have to remove something else, I think. The PSU shroud. Where is the hard drive? This is also one of the exciting things. Looking for the part. There it is. The, 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 uh, the shroud or however you call it. Install that. But it says actually you have to remove the back cover. Interesting. Okay. Each case has its own style. And you have to kind of feel it out how it works. Just adding to the overall experience like that one. You have to open the drive bay first before you can install it fancy and then close that out then plug the cable in so like the the sata connection i believe where is that here connect that via sata and connect that to the psu there you go that looks good and then we can connect the cables like so and that one right that looks good side panel bring that back let's put it up at the same time work in parallel here save up a lot of money one second that's not good because we need to install first the PSU shroud <laughs> Customer might complain, where is a shroud? Good. And just like that, we have completed fixing three PCs. And we'll be earning a lot of money a few seconds from now. You guys ready? You guys ready to make some dough? Right, here we go. Collect. Woohoo! Collect. Oh my goodness, we're rich. And collect. Super Pro, 703 now. We leveled up as well. And we have new PC parts. Oh my goodness, that is amazing. I'm enjoying this game. Hope you guys are too. But that is the end of this episode. Hope to see you guys soon. And in the meantime, make sure to subscribe in the channel so that you are aware of the videos that are coming out soon. And looking forward to our next episode. Thanks for watching guys. Have a nice day. And make sure to have a look in the video description as well. For any of the relevant links. Steam page and all that stuff. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Catch you in the next episode. Clumsy signing off. Bye bye.